Hi everyone, this is Casey. Um, I just am about to, to make an envelope uh, for holding uh, some of the things that I am going to send along with my Sunshine album. You can see that. This is like a standard one and it's large enough to hold all of the little extra goodies that I want to send with the album. <clears throat> Here's the, the package that it came out of. I wanted a more, instead of like this, color I was thinking I would do more of a um, more of a natural look so I just thought you know what I'm gonna turn on the camera and just take you along for the ride <laughs> with me as I attempt to uh, do this on camera so watch this be a fail and <laughs> that would be hilarious then I could just still upload it to um, fail army or something I wanted to use this as a template which I clearly butchered it right here trying to open it up so um yeah uh anyway uh so here it is just opened up so that way i could use it as a template and then i had some craft a craft roll and it's all rolled up it's like but it's like a craft paper roll the only problem is is that it wants to roll up so i already drew around the template here it is just trying to unroll it here let me i don't know can you see oh let me zoom out a little bit there. I don't know if that's a little bit better or not. Um, and please forgive me if I don't get things right on filming. I'm a newbie. So um, so anyway, I have drawn also where I need to score it. And I've already cut out the shape, like the shape in general. I don't know if you can see that. All right. So anyway, I have a very big scoreboard. Like I said, it just wants to roll up, so it just makes it like really difficult to try to do. I'm probably going to do a horrible job at scoring this. It's scoring it. There we go. It's on the other side. Looks like I'm going to just hit the camera. Let me just see if I can line this up a little bit. Good thing I put that black line on it. It helps me. I'm sorry. Some other people on YouTube doing that, and I didn't know why until I started scoring stuff like this. Let me just hold it down. Okay, I'm back. I don't know if it helped. Maybe it did. Obviously, I don't even have to hold it down right now. Uh, but it's still kind of bowing a little bit, but has a little tendency to curl up. But it's way better than what it was. I wish I would have done that kind of sooner. Let me go to like that. Find this score line. Get my bun folder again. Sorry. If I was more prepared, I swear. Probably get a lot farther. All right. And this one. Kind of soft creasing it until I get it right where I want it. Okay, that's those. And this one. Hopefully you can see. Is this the bottom flap? I think it is, yeah, because I... I drew the circle here, so I'm just flipping this around. I'm just using my phone to record. I don't know if this is a the best thing to record on. I really don't know what other people use. But man, there are a lot of good videos out there. Okay. There's that. All right, now well, let's see here. So it's going to look something like that. I don't know. I might want to do some sort of decorative element over the top. I'm making this for my, um, I did a mini album that is uh, sunflower themed. 
and I'm just finishing that up now. Um, but I really, a lot of times if I am going to be sending something with, I like it to have, um, packaging that will go with it really, or as best I can. I mean, sometimes there's nothing you can do and, and life happens, we know, but the mini album is like a more of a natural sunflower uh theme as well i've got some pieces of what is this here i can't remember where i ordered this it could have been off of amazon <clears throat> but it's a printable burlap so i guess i have a couple pieces one's like a little bit more goldeny or richer or whatever and then this is more like a really neutral or faded kind of comparative this one also seems to have like a tighter weave this one's more open i don't know but i don't have enough of that it doesn't look like but i have let me see put that in there oh a lot of this the richer one let's pull some of this out here all right let's see what this looks like okay hmm well still not quite big enough but i don't think i mind seeing the natural craft behind it really it's it seems okay and then i wonder would that fit there mm. should i do all four sides I'm asking you guys these questions as if you can answer me right now. That'd be nice though, actually. Let me just grab. Good thing I have a lot of these. All right. Okay. You know what? That that looks pretty good. Maybe I'm gonna go for this kind of look. And I'm just gonna start trying to glue it on Fabri-Tac glue sorry glue strings this is like it's interesting because when i've used it it makes glue strings like how like hot glue has those little glue strings or whatever anyway all right okay let's just glue this down i guess huh one step at a time i guess that's all i can ever do really just I've been trying to learn um, embroidery and you know when I see stuff like this it makes me think maybe it would have been cute to embroider something on it and then stick it down but hindsight I guess huh all right so let's see here I think I want to Put this under here so I can kind of draw around it a little bit. All right. Maybe if I use these to kind of line it up. Not that I've been doing that this whole time. <laughs> I guess I should have just planned better. And is this not cut straight? Or maybe I just don't have it straight. Oh well. 
I just kind of eye it a little bit there. And then I need a pencil. Okay. I'm going to go like this. And then like that. Hopefully it's going to be okay because I did it on the reverse side. I don't know. I'm kind of just doing this on the fly. I, like I said, I was just doing this by myself, just packaging up some stuff. And, and I thought, oh, you know what? Just go for it. I have to say I was a little nervous. This is my first recording experience, really. All right. Will that fit in there? Ooh, yeah, I think maybe, 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 maybe. All right, I don't know if I should kind of follow that. Mm, I don't know, it kind of bothers me that it doesn't follow the line, but that's not so bad though, really. Okay. And then for here, let me see if I can put a hole and then I'll have, I'll know at least where the hole is. So let me find some sort of punch. All right, I have this. This is We Are Memory Keepers, even though it doesn't say We Are Memory Keepers on it. Well, it says We Are, but not the Memory Keepers part of it. Anyway, I'm going to go with the one-fourth of an inch. Is that, is that what we're thinking here? Is that, does that look about the same? Let me see. Let me just... Uh, Maybe is it five sixteenth? It's probably more like it. Hmm. Okay, I'll go with five sixteenth, and I will punch this here, and then I'll glue the thing down. There we go. Okay, let me that aside there. All right, so fabric tack. Let me just move you guys over so you can kind of still see, hopefully. All right. I'm really getting ready for spring here. Um, I live in uh, North Pole, Alaska. And it's not the North Pole, um, but it is indeed called North Pole, Alaska. And they totally use that to their advantage uh, and use it as a tourist. They do it up. They, they've even decorate, uh, decorated the street lights with like candy cane colors. And they have a Santa's workshop. And anyway... Hopefully that's stuck down okay. And yeah, they do the whole tourist thing, live it up all the way. Um, and as of right now, today is April 21st of two, 2023. And I need another piece of that. Uh, and there is snow just piled up outside. And I think in other parts of the country, it's some of my daughters and our older grown children uh, and our sons are living in other states now and they're dealing with nice warm weather and all kinds of stuff like that. And I'm like send a little bit this way because I just can't wait for spring to come. Okay. I think I want it to line up with this like general in general
I can use my perfect triangle cutters. I can't cut straight for anything. <laughs> so, I'm just trying to see if I can cut it because I have a grip. It's saving so much time and energy. Okay. I'm going to put this in my paper cutter and we are going to see if this is going to cut it. You guys are probably like, no, what are you doing? Okay, almost, almost. Didn't seem to be hard. All right, there we go. Maybe I can use the other for the other side. Are these equal, equal sizes here? No, nah, a little bit different. This one. Was this the one I wanted to use? Hmm. Let me see if I just kind of give it a little bit of a here. And it goes like that, and so I'm just gonna put it over. This way, about. I don't know if that's going to put it. Maybe I don't know. We'll try it. I think gradual would look better, but it's just not. Then it's just going to be too wide. Maybe I don't know. All right. Well, we'll try the smaller amount first. Do I even want that? I, I can't even see it. I'm just eyeballing this. I really... Okay. This one comes down and this one almost goes straight across. So I don't know. We're, I guess we're just going to roll with this. And... Use this as a template. Cut this other side piece. Assuming that it they're the same, one and the same, but watch it probably isn't. <laughs> All right, so let me see here. I'm just going to put a mark on this, saying which one is the top. This is top. Okay. I'm going to go like this. Hopefully you guys can see everything I'm doing here. And on this side... Okay, so I want it to face the... Okay, that was uh, my daughter that was calling, and I didn't want to miss it. Okay, so I think... Yeah, I think I'm going to do this sandwich together like this. So that way, when I have this one cut here, it will flip over and be on the right side, I hope. I hope I'm thinking right. Okay, so let's see here. I'm just gonna draw a line of where I did that mark. Going down. Okay. Okay. 
So um, between me and my husband, we have uh, what's that there? dog hair. If you see a dog hair, just know that's just kind of part of what comes sometimes is when you have a whole bunch of dogs. We had five dogs at one point. Uh, they're um, labs, and then we have one lab, uh, half lab, half uh, uh, Australian Shepherd. And so we have three labs now, and full full blood labs, and then we have one half uh, lab, half Australian Shepherd, and the one that we had that uh, we actually just lost. Uh, he was a Staffordshire Terrier, and that was very hard for me because that was my dog and. Uh, he was very special to me, but we had him for a really long time. He was about 15 years old, give or take. We never really knew how old he was. We, he was a rescue, and he was, he was very special to me. Anyway, we just lost him uh, last spring. Oops, sorry if I bumped that. that was too hard. I didn't mean to. I'll try to find a better setup. I don't know if this is... Okay, um, so anyway, now we have just the, just the other four. Line it up with these. All right, how did I do this last time? I think, oh, I put it under here. Okay. All right, well, let's give this a shot. So hopefully you guys are doing well. Everyone's doing okay. Are you guys looking forward to spring? I know I am. In the winter times here, it is uh, not only cold, sometimes dangerously cold. There was one time we saw negative 75 here. I've only lived up here for about 10 years though. Um, I'm originally from Michigan. Over like that. All right, like that. Um, so, yeah, when it's that cold, I guess it's pretty dangerous as we might think that it would be. Well, that doesn't look straight at all, huh? <laughs> That's funny. Um, like that. See, that just looks really, that is just so, is it actually curved? I think it is. It's just the way I did the template, I guess, or the way I cut it. Yeah, it figures. I wonder if I could just cut off a little bit with the trimmer. Whoops. Wow, things go flying everywhere. Okay, well, the fraying actually, we'll just go with it. We'll just go with it. We're going to be right can't tell it's going to be on the bottom anyway so like you know what we're just going to go with it I'm all right I'm just gonna it's funny how I say we're just going to go with it and then I'm still fiddling with it I Okay, good enough. We're just, we're for real this time. We're going with it. Okay. Um, but I think I was telling you that between my husband and I, um, we have six children. And they're all adults. Our youngest one is 20. And... They're doing awesome, like really awesome. So half still live here in the state that we live in right now, Alaska. But the other half. Did I mess that up? 
All right, so I was seeing that it wasn't quite lined up with the So I'm just going to try to do this on the fly, really. I don't know, maybe I can't do it. Let's see. I don't want it to stick down yet. Oy. Well, you get to see the real me, I guess, huh? Let's see. I don't want this to go here. There we go. All right, now I'm just gonna try to run. Oof, sorry, sorry, that was really loud. Let's see. That's gonna. That's gonna be so much better. We're gonna. We're gonna go with that. Okay, round two. Anyway, uh, so yeah, half are living here in Alaska, and half are now out of. Alaska living in what we call the lower 48. So it's the continental United States down there. And they're all in um, different states too. So one is um, in California. And one's in Minnesota. And one is in Michigan as of right now and we're about to have our fourth grandchild and uh yeah only one thing i can say about them living so far away is i miss them and i i can't see them as much as i want to or just kind of just be around and there to help if you know they needed something or whatever All right, I think, all right, so where are we at here? What do we got? Here we are. Kind of big when it's all opened up like that. That's where it's at. Okay, so let me just flip this over. And here's my little spot right there that, for the hole. So let me get that hole punch thing again. I don't know what this thing is actually called, but hole puncher, maybe. It's not a one of those crocodiles. I don't have one of those. Although there's many times where I wish I did. Because I think those set eyelets and stuff, and as of right now, I can't set eyelets just easily. Speaking of, maybe I should put an eyelet right there. I don't know. What do you guys think, huh? Hold on. Let me see if I can find an eyelet. <clears throat> okay. I got this. It has like all these different little eyelets and a little eyelet setter thing. I've got glue all over my hands still. Okay. All right. So let me see. I think I'm going to go for... You know what? Do I want black? Because this is kind of a... Oop. Oh. Well, this is kind of a... Well, black might be nice. Since I'm, I'm going to be sending this with the sunflower. It's either that or this one. I kind of am drawn to this one naturally just because of the natural colors. I don't know. Or black. There it is lined up. I don't know if you guys can see that, but can't tell. I think I'm just going to go with the natural one, just because I think that's going to be more, I don't know, accepted. Is the natural theme? I don't know if that make it, makes any sense at all. I think I got to do this. It's been a while. I think I do it like this. Flip it over and I have it still in there. And then I put this through here. Right there. 
that. Okay. So it's poking through. I just put this little thing there. And this little thing has like a little hole in it. And that goes right over the top. Kind of like that. And then, sorry guys, but this is going to be loud. Oop, I kind of mangled it up. Oh well. Kind of where, oh, sorry if you couldn't see. It's kind of where it's coming out. Hold on one second. All right, so let's see. So as of right now, this is kind of what it looks like. All right, cut this. Is that gonna? Yeah. Okay. Good. Phew. Yep, still looks mangled. I don't know. Maybe I just lack the finesse. Okay. Might want to do have some jute cord. That'd be kind of cute, wouldn't it? Um, where's this? Smaller one. It's a little darker. I don't know, let's see here. How would I put it through? Let me just cut off a little piece of this. You guys get to watch me struggle mentally as I try to figure out how. Because I'm thinking, well, if I want it to be tied, I could just have it so it goes through. Uh, but it would look cute with a little bow, wouldn't it? Since it's going to be holding the... Yeah, maybe. Let me see. Two double ply or whatever would fit through here, so that's good. Let me just hold that in there. Just putting that through there like that. So it just holds it. And I want to see if I have it like, oops, wrong place, like that. In general, I'm just trying to do a prequel to the sequel or whatever. It's probably not even accurate. Don't mind me, guys. All right. How do we make a bow again? I've always sucked at making bows, honestly. My daughter Jordan is just, she did these bows for her sister's wedding, and wow, I got pictures of them even, they're really nice. Okay, come on, cooperate. What do you guys think? Like something like that, huh? Of course, this would be all shut. I think I'm gonna go with that, but how do I. All right, well, I can't just leave my bone folder in there to hold it together. Let me think. I could try it. I could tie a really big fat knot, but I don't know. Also, let me see how well this actually will shut. I might want to. If 
Well, I don't know. I can't tell if it's actually going to matter or not. Well, I'm just going to march forth here. Not the date, just as in. It's in there now. It is in there now. All right, so still we are left with... What did I do with that piece of string? Oh, there it is. It was sitting right over there. That's what happens when I have a cluttered desk. I'm still left with the question of how in the world I'm going to hold that in there without it being too bulky. Oh, hold on. I think I have... I think I might have something. Hold on. It's supposed to be like a little, I don't know what they're called, like barbed. Barbed something. Cord. Does it say on the thing? Let me see. So here's the thing here. It says Mandala Crafts. Mandela crafts elastic bar and it says something inch dot 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 500 barbs gold tone so if you guys know what that is what the actual term is maybe you could comment down below what those are called but I think I want some oh, oops sorry I want some smaller ones too because they would really come in handy for some other stuff that I make. I want to get this kind of maybe like that, kind of centered a little bit. Oh man, I think it's going to be more hammering. I don't know, maybe I can just. Oh. Let me. Oh, hold on. I think I have some wires that are some clip or whatever those things are called. It's like for jewelry, like like that. And uh, smoosh it. Smoosh it in there. Is this how you do it even? I don't know, actually. Okay, and I've got that side in there. Let me get this side down. There we go. I don't know if this is right. <laughs> well, I guess we're going to find out. Is it supposed to be on each side? Am I supposed to even flatten this? Sorry, you guys have to... Oh, hopefully I didn't put my head right in there. I don't know. All right, let's just, let's just see how this works. Well, I didn't get it exactly even, did I? That's what it looks like on the other side. I don't know if you guys can see I'm running out of room on my desk. Probably isn't how you do it at all. I have no idea, but we're trying to use what we have around us, I guess. Or I am, anyway. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and go for it and try to glue this. Okay. 
this is dry I, don't, I really don't know how long it takes fabric tech or fabric yeah fabric tech to set up um i have the hardest time getting it up here i have to like go around about just to try to because it seems like every time i try to order it they're like this product will not we cannot ship it to your location every time so it's like and it's like that with a lot of other things too sometimes i've even had to resort to sending it to my mom's house hmm. let me try to see if i can cut that ever ever so slightly this is probably a good idea Well, she's in there now, guys. All right, here we go. Let's see. But yeah, I've even had to, when it comes to ordering stuff and getting it up here, I've had to send stuff to my parents' house who are in Michigan. And then just to have them, have them send it up here to me. Or I'll get it when I fly back there and fly up with it. Like just basic items, like for exist, uh, example of the the Fabri-Tac stuff, or even other things like even like makeup and paper things, like just all kinds of stuff that you're just like surprised that it would be such a problem. All right, so I'm trying to decide if I should. You know, I think that's fine. I think I'm just going to leave it like that. Because then if they want to change that, or whoever ends up getting the Sunshine album. Because this is just meant to hold the stuff. It's just a, a vessel for this, the little goodies I'm going to be sending with the album. Just for funsies, really. I just like to do that sometimes. You know, I really just want to bless someone. Okay, so let's just go with that. Let's just, we're just going to move forward here, I guess. So a little, okay, make the bunny ears and you tie the bunny ears together or something. Sounds kind of mean. Uh, not real bunnies. No bunnies were harmed in the making of this video. Now it's sticking to my hands because I still have glue on my hands. 
I'm gonna have to shower after I do this. I don't know. Okay, so that's that's that. Let me move the blue bottle out of the way and we'll see what we got. We got this. And here's the other side. Glue pieces and fabric pieces everywhere. All right. That's the side. The other side. Yeah, you know, I I kind of am just don't know if I want to do anything more to it. I I really like the simpleness of it and the cleanness of it. Clean but rustic, I guess. I don't know. I I really kind of like that right now. And uh, yeah, because this is just gonna like I said, it's just holding the goodies. It's really not even part of uh, this album in any kind of way. So. There's no need to overcomplicate. It's funny I say that because I pretty much live my life overcomplicating things. Not intentionally, I just, I just do that. I don't know why. I don't know, I just want this to go down. Maybe I did this wrong. Is it this way? This way. I don't know. You guys are probably like, what are you doing? All right, so there, there it is. Here, here she is in all of her glory. And, yep, and so now I can hold, it's a regular um, file folder, like in reference, just so you guys, we can go back. This is what it was, just a regular, not a file fo folder, but I don't know, whatever these things are called, um, envelopes. And then now this is so before and after, before and after, flip over and after. Okay, well, thanks for hanging out with me, guys. And this has been fun uh, doing this craft along with me. And hopefully you guys are having a great day and I'll talk to you later.